Nociplastic pain. It's not well understood, but it's believed that the central nervous system is involved or overstimulated, as in distorting the pain signals. The pain is multifocal, more widespread or intense, or both, than expected based on the amount of tissue or nerve damage present. And, and it can include other CNS-type symptoms, such as fatigue and sleep, memory, and mood problems. No plastic pain. This type of pain occurs in isolation, as often occurs in conditions such as fibromyalgia, or as part of a mixed pain state in combination with ongoing nociceptive or neuropathic pain, as might occur in chronic low back pain. It's important to recognize this type of pain, since it's going to respond differently to different therapies than nociceptive pain, and it has a decreased responsiveness to peripherally directed therapies, such as anti-inflammatory drugs and opioid surgery or injections. The etiology of nosoplastic pain is it's caused by an ongoing inflammation and damage of tissues and neuropathic pain. Fibromyalgia and other chronic conditions that are known to cause pain, chronic low back pain, and other forms of ongoing nociceptive or neuropathic pain which have overstimulated the nerve system are what causes this. When assessing pain, look for these additional nosoplastic pain descriptors. Multifocal, so the patient may identify several areas, or it could be generalized. It's widespread. It's usually intense. And it frequently includes fatigue, sleep, memory, and mood problems. Mm -hmm.